Hello everyone, um, it seems that uh, Resident Evil 25th Anniversary Scotch Whiskey has just been announced. You're probably wondering, where is this coming from? Well, it could be coming from Johnny Walker, though the um, laser, laser engraving, I'll show you the vlogs. I mean, I will show you the box. Unlike everyone else, see, there's the box. Ain't that lovely? Isn't that lovely? Laser engraved slide out lid. I mean, we can get that to focus. Yeah, that does say Biohazard, 25th anniversary, age 25 years, cast strength. So, what can we take away from this bit of information? Uh, start checking. Checking everywhere. Um, it's from Glenn Frazier's Distillery. Ooh, I was looking at Johnny Walker before. I'm like, oh, I could do with some Johnny Walker. So, let's see if we can actually uh, get a little bit more information. See if they can actually go pre order for. Of course, I'm of drinking age. Mm. Down the news. Uh, Glenn First Class celebrates 185 years. Ooh, that's nice. But is there any news on the Resident Evil one? No. Kind of stupid, really. Oh, well, let's have a look at the whiskey. Now we got single malt, family cast range. You know what? Had um, I had Dan Murphy's open, the Australian version, Australian site. Let's see if I can find. And yes, I have found some. In Australia. Uh, the closest one I can get in Australia would be the Glen Fast Class 25th, 25 year old single malt Scotch whiskey in a 700ml bottle. That's about it. Though, if anyone does actually have a spare $25,000 Australian sitting around, I will actually test, I will actually taste test the 60 year old single malt Scotch, Scotch whiskey because A, the bottle looks so damn awesome. And I do mean the bottle looks that awesome. Oh, that bow would do lovely just sitting on my desk. Uh, let me just see if I can find that nearby. Oh God. It ain't near me. So, yeah, 
I don't have a spare 25 grand that Australia, that's for sure. <laughs> that's the 30 year. Damn. I want the, um, not spending $747.95 Australian on a 30 year one. So, I found, like I said, I found the 25 year old single malt scotch whiskey. Though Dan Murphy has actually done the Game of Thrones and the Director's Cut version, collect, well, limited edition, um, Blade Runner 2049. Hey. Uh, none. None near me. So I would have to pay two hundred and what is it? Thirty one dollars ninety just to get one. Delivered. I mean, it's it's good. It's a award winner. That's for sure. I mean, it's got what five average customer rating, four point five. So five people gave it five stars. Five people gave four stars. I can test this because I'm actually looking at Dan Murphy's website with the the uh, reviews. So, oh, it comes it comes from Scotland. Good old Scotland. Region is Speyside, or Speyside. I'm sorry about the name there, but yeah, there's no news from Ben Fastless on anything for it. I mean, I can have a look at the range. That's about it. But yeah, there's no, no other information. And yes, I forgot to mention, we are talking about alcohol here. Though, of a different variety, considering that this is actually news that came out today. And I'm trying to find... Yeah, no pre-order, no nothing. Damn it! Ooh, the family cast. Cask. That actually looks nice, that, that box. That's, that's nice. I, I'm, I'm loving the family cask box. box. That's, yeah. Uh, I mean, I can go for a 30 year old one, but yeah, there's no. Um, I'm just looking on another website for it. Hoping her nah. Damn. Nothing. There's virtually nothing on another website. I mean Go to another alcoholic website. That another website that actually sells alcohol. No, this video is not for kids. So get them away from this video. Wow! Nothing.
Let's see, is there a zilch? I'm getting no results from one website. From website that. One website was asking for um was asking for my um And nothing. <laughs> oh, this is annoying. You're trying to find something that you actually want to pre-order, and yet you can't find it because no one's got the page up, or they haven't actually been told about it. Or I could find out that it's um that is actually a U.S. based thing, and not for anyone else around the world, apart from Scotland, England. Uh, I think European side, which means Australia would probably be, here's our badge, type style, again. Gee, just like Capcom USA on one side of the stories too, when he's a ruined collector's edition, huh? I'm not letting that go. So yeah, that's it for this video. Um, I am looking at um. I might get my Nintendo. Might start my Nintendo Switch and, and yeah. see what I can uh, record from the demo. And I do mean what I can actually show from the demo. <sighs> Might have some some Lego news as well. Hmm. I think I may have some Lego news I can share. <laughs> That's next video. See you until then.